Now then, here it is, chat GPT, everyone's talking about it at the moment. Is it going to take our jobs? We don't know. i tell you what it can do. It can upgrade our mountain bike, hopefully. This thing is super, sim super simple. All you're going to do is type in any question and it gives you a flipping answer in seconds. So I've typed in, give me some simple upgrades to make to my hardtail mountain bike. Um, here we go, and it's spitting them out already. Right, so here are a few simple upgrades that you can make to your hardtail mountain bike, it says. Number one, new tires. <coughs> if your tires are worn out or not suitable for the type of terrain you ride on, consider replacing them with something more suitable. I wonder if you can get into the nuance of it then suggesting the t right type of brand and model of tire based on the terrain that you put in that you ride on. Maybe for the next video. Anyway, two, new pedals. If you don't like the pedals that came with your bike, or if they're worn out, consider replacing them with a new set. That sounds like pretty much common sense. Uh, there are many different types of pedals available, such as clipless, platform, and BMX pedals. So we've got two contact points so far. I think it's doing pretty well. I think if we'd written this ourselves, we would have definitely started with tires, probably with pedals, and I would have said saddle third. This is saying handlebars. So number three, new handlebar. If you want to change the way your bike handles or if your handlebars are bent or damaged, consider replacing them with a new set. I don't need a chat bot to tell me that if my handlebar is bent, I need a new one. So thanks for that technology. There are many different types of handlebars available, such as flat bars, riser bars, and drop bars. Drop bars this part of the big big industry push to make everyone ride a gravel bike and they want they want me to turn my hardtail into some sort of gravel bike it's not happening drop bars aren't going on my bike number four new seat seat is interesting I'm surprised they didn't say saddle if your seat is uncomfortable or worn out consider replacing it with a new one yeah i mean my saddle's completely shredded there's holes in it it's falling apart and it's uncomfortable to sit on do I need a chatbot to tell me to get a new one? Probably not. There are many different types of seats available, such as saddle seats, bucket seats, and saddle seats with a backrest. This feels like it's talking about something different to the, the hardtail mountain bikes we're used to. I wonder if it's referencing like the old school BMX style things. You used to have the big bucket seat with the, the rest at the back. So maybe, I wonder if we needed to be more specific with our question for that one. Who knows? It's doing well so far, apart from the seat, I'd say. Anyway, number five, new grips. If your grips are worn out or not comfortable, consider replacing them with a new set. There are many different types of grips available, such as lock-on grips, single clamp grips, and double clamp grips. I bloody love a double clamp grip. Grip. Easy for me to say. Okay, so that's five top ones. I think it's bang on. Some of the, the words that, they, that the bot uses are pretty nuanced. Um, and maybe that's my bad for putting in the wrong question. But it seems bang on. Grips, saddle, handlebar, pedals, tyres, all contact points, all super important. Let's order some and change it up on my bike. Hey everyone, so here it is. This is the hardtail that AI has upgraded. So let's take a closer look at it. Starting with these fresh bits of rubber from Maxxis. This is a pair of Maxxis shorty uh, tyres. These are going to be perfect in the conditions we got now. Really muddy, kind of horrible out there. Today, it's full of snow, so we, you just know that the trails are going to be so boggy. These will be perfect. Nice little upgrade. Thanks for that tip, chatbot. Then we got a lovely little saddle from WTB. That's going to be uh, make our rides way more comfortable than the standard thing that came on this bike. Excited to try that out, but my attention really is drawn to the front of the bike. Check it out. Look at this new carbon handlebar from Hope. It's a beautiful looking thing in this raw carbon look. Some useful little bits on there. There's, um, there's measurements as to where you should put your, or where you could put your brakes. That looks so nice. Beautiful thing, super lightweight. Way more light than the, uh, the alloy handlebar that came on this bike. And it looks pimp. Um, what else have we got? Like these grips. These ODI grips, they're really nice. I mean, let's face it, OEM grips are usually, they do the job, but when you put your hands on a thing like this, not only is that really tacky rubber, they've got little grooves on them. 
so you can get maximum grip when you're out in the trails when things get a little bit sketchy. And then down there, we've got a nice pair of Nuke Proof Horizon flat pedals. What do you think of the color? Does the color match with this frame color? Hmm, should we go on with black? I don't know. What I do know is they're a quality pair of flat pedals. They're my go-to and I love them. So there you go. This is the hardtail that Chat GPT upgraded. Let me know what you think of it down in the comments below. And if you've done any upgrades recently, love to hear about them. And before I go, what do you think of this room I'm in? If you want to know more about it, because we really need your help, click up there right now. Okay, okay.